Hey guys, Sean here from s &P. Today here with Jamie Smith, executive chef at the Abode Hotels. He's going to be showing us a very simple fish dish that we can all cook. So now I'm going to cook a quick fish dish. Whenever you're cooking any dishes, if you want all your food in ingredients on the dish to be ready at the same time, prepare whatever's going to take longest first. So in this instance, it's going to be my cauliflower. So I'll get that on first. So I boil my kettle. So I've got my water already hot. So I like to square off my florets, but that's just me. So the cauliflower is cooking. So now I'm going to get my fish on. Again, coconut oil. Here I'm using cod, boneless and skinless. With this cod, I'm going to be uh, adding some spices to it. So I'm going to use the packaging it's come in to, as like my mixing bowl. So I'm going to go down sort of like the Indian sort of theme. So again, a bit of turmeric, a bit of ground coriander, a bit of cumin, a bit of ground ginger, and a bit of uh, mild curry powder and salt. So I'm just going to rub all those spices in. And then I'm just going to pan fry that. So now I'm cooking my fish. I'm going to make a little uh, yogurt dip. Also to save a bit of time, I like to use uh, Tilda Pure Basmati or any of the Tilda range are all very nice. Not so bad for you. So through my yogurt, I'm going to put some uh, chopped coriander. Bit of mint. A touch of lemon juice. So now I'm just gonna mix those ingredients together. That's gonna act as our dressing or dip or sauce. As you can see, it's got some uh, nice colors from the spices. Fish doesn't take too uh, long to cook. So now what I'm gonna do to finish the fish off is I'm gonna turn the hob off but leave it in the pan. And I'm gonna add a touch of good quality grass fed butter. I'm gonna swirl it around the pan. Till the butter melts. And then what I'm going to do is something called basting. So turn the pan at an angle, spoonful of butter, pour it back over the fish. So you're getting all those flavours. <clears throat> and then fish always marries well with lemon, so I'm a bit more lemon to the dish. Drizzle that over. Get a final baste. Now I'm going to serve up. If the cauliflower had been sat there too long and I'd got cold, you can always just give it a quick 30 seconds in the microwave. So the rice is ready, depending on your macro allowance. Depends on how much you're allowed. Cauliflower. Your 
fish. And then the yogurt we made. And you can just finish it with some uh, fresh chilies. That's that.